Good morning. Someone is snuggling in my bed. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 26. No, I guess it's not Vlogmas Day 26. Welcome to another episode of the Marathon. We're back to normal daily vlogs, everybody. The exact same thing, just a different intro. <laughs> Have you noticed that we've now got the good camera in the car? Ooh, ooh. Thanks to James, who after me trying to do this for an extremely frustrating amount of time, did it in two seconds. So, thanks buddy. <laughs> I said to him after, I was like, you may regret being so good because I might ask you to do other stuff. <laughs> Now I am driving to pick up my niece Elizabeth and we're gonna go Boxing Day shopping. I realized the Boxing Day is not a thing in every country. In Canada, it's basically, most stores are open and they have deals. That's it. It's just an excuse to go shopping with my niece today, basically. And I know in yesterday's video I said, <clears throat> Did I say I would talk about Christmas? I think I did. But I feel the last few days have been pretty all over the place, crazy, and so I wanted to just take some time to chat with you because I've got about an hour before picking her up. Christmas went, I think, better than I expected. I think, you know, I honestly last night just like self high fived that it was over. I was like, now people don't have to ask me what I'm doing. Now it's done. It's another check mark. I thought about Christmas's past, obviously, and there was a lot of really hard ones, to be frank. So. I tried to just keep things as like chill as possible. Really didn't go on social media, didn't talk to anyone, just had some quality time with Thomas as you saw and then it was amazing to go to Leanne's parents for dinner. It was so lovely, we were all in our PJs and so nice to hang out with the girls. We played Guess Who. Thomas figured out how to throw Elmo from my phone to um, Bill's TV, Bill and Arlene's TV, which was hilarious. I wish I had filmed a look on his face when he figured out what he had done. He was so proud of himself, it was so cute. So, honestly, it sucked. I felt very far away from my loved ones and my family. But like I said in last night's video, you guys really helped me not feel far away, and they did too. I had lovely presents to open. And today to look forward to, and it was nice that Jeremy's mom came. That was really lovely. The fact that she drove for like four and a half hours on Christmas day to come spend time with us. And I asked her like, what do you wanna do while you're here? And she's like, I just wanna spend time with Thomas. I was like, great, I'm gonna take a nap. <laughs> I was up in the night. Thomas wasn't, he slept through until about six, but I was up from about two to five, wide awake. I think I did a little boxing day shopping in the middle of the night too. <laughs> Definitely ordered some stuff on Amazon and made a list of some stuff that I want. So I wanna get a lot of books today and I'm gonna get a book light so that I, I'm gonna try reading in the middle of the night without having to turn my light on and see if that helps. But I'm past the point of being upset about it. There's nothing, I, like I'm doing everything I should. Getting upset just makes it worse. So it's all good. Although this morning I definitely had a little panic feeling of, oh my gosh, I'm neglecting my clients, which I'm not. You know, I told them all December 1st that I'd be taking this week off, but I just had this little panic feeling of like, oh, I should check things, because this is the first time I've taken time off from my business ever. 
except after Jeremy died, which doesn't count. So that's really, I'm having to just let that go. <laughs> I know they're fine, I know their pages are fine, everyone's good, but, whew. Yeah, definitely had a little moment of, oh, guilt, like, oh, I need to be focusing on them, which I don't. <laughs> it's all good. I haven't even opened all the presents yet. I still have some presents from you guys to open. I think I said this yesterday, Thomas, like he just doesn't like Christmas morning. He doesn't understand opening presents. And I tried, I was like, oh, I'll time lapse this. And he just hated it. And I was like, you know what? I'm not gonna force this. Just because our Christmas morning isn't the typical Christmas morning doesn't mean it's not beautiful. And yesterday was okay. So, of course it really upsets me, like, just because I want him to experience that magic, but he doesn't want to open presents, that's okay. So I just like opened them slowly, took a break, would open some more, show them to him. He's a man of very simple needs, my T-Bone, and I love him. Anyway, so I still have more presents to open. And of course, Grandma brought some. I'm just doing it really chill. Really looking forward to seeing my niece. Just thrilled for a day of shopping without Thomas, to be frank. Like, the fact that he's hanging out with his grandma all day today. Amazing. Amazing. So I'm gonna be present and enjoy it and hopefully get some good stuff to show you. Now I'm gonna go back to listening to You Are a Badass by Jen Sincero. <laughs> Here. Oh my gosh, they look amazing. Oh, those are so cute. So I'm in roots trying on all the sweatpants. Just, yep. I wanted to go home with a pair of sweatpants, so here's hoping one of these works. Okay, we've come to the chop leaf. I realized I didn't film at all because Boxing Day was crazy. But now we're having lunch. And I'm so hungry, it's two o'clock. So here we go. We're gonna eat. Shortest ever, BRB. Hi, thought I would check in, say goodnight. Uh, I'm gonna do my Boxing Day haul in tomorrow's video. Didn't vlog much, as I said, while we were shopping because it was just so busy and we were on like a mission and we were on a fun date together, me and Elizabeth, and it was just like, good. It was really good. And then I reached a point where I was like, we should have eaten an hour and a half ago. <laughs> so we did the mall and we did winners and I was gonna do Michael's but I didn't need to so I'll show you what I bought tomorrow. Did I say I was gonna do my haul yesterday? That may be how tired I am. And then on the hour drive home, I was listening to You Are a Badass, but halfway through the drive, I had to just put on like loud music and I had to turn the heat down because I was like, I'm gonna nod off. That's how tired I was. <laughs> Came home, um, we exchanged gifts with Thomas's grandma and then we just went out to dinner to Boston Pizza. Now she's giving him a bath and I am legit going to bed. My house is such a tip. I think that's what the British YouTubers say. My nails are just like awful, but I'm, it was such a great day with Elizabeth, but I need to go to bed. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. On, I was gonna say vlog, but say 26, but yes. <sighs> Another episode of the Marathon Lace on a Sprint. It's a marathon, lace up and subscribe today some really meaningful conversation in the Facebook group today. Just like babes supporting babes, getting help on some really like tough stuff. And I'm just so touched to see you guys helping each other and the feedback that I'm having from different women saying how much they love the marathoner group and how much they love being a marathoner. 
pleases me to no end, obviously, but me and this giant puppy, <laughs> oh, my Christmas tree, are gonna say goodnight. Um, yeah, thanks for hanging out today. I just, I'm gonna leave all my shopping in the bags and then I'll film a haul tomorrow, but TBH. It's time for this mama to go wash her face and go to bed and self high five that we made it through today. Not that today was bad, but it was just a rough night and preceded by some tough days. So tomorrow's my last day off from the radio station somehow. It's already been a week. So I'm gonna really enjoy it. And uh, yeah, it was interesting this morning how I was telling you that I was feeling a little bit guilty about not working. The section that I listened to from Badass was about how you need to take a break from work and that the world will continue without you and that it's fine. And I was just like, thank you universe. <laughs> okay, that's it. That's enough rambling for this one. Okay, life's not a sprint, it's a marathon and this very tired marathoner see you tomorrow for my boxing day haul which is always one of my favorite videos every year to film and to watch good night <laughs>